Right, hello everybody. Welcome to the CCL Season 23, is it, final? It is. It is. I'm here with Artemis. Hello, Artemis. Hello. And, uh, yeah, we've got Wolfbark with Chorfs versus Cyber Knight with Bretts. Cyber Knight always uses Bretts. Uh, Wolfbark going with Chorfs. Wolfbark's got loads of Mighty Blow, loads of Guard, um, which is quite good. <laughs> he's induced a loner, uh, mercenary Chorf blocker with Guard, and he's also induced a Bribe. Um, about 1760 TV his team was. Um, Cyber Knight's got about 2k. Uh, Brett's he's at home, so bought a wizard stadium. So they both got a wizard. And uh, Cyber Knight's got loads of plus strength, but he's also got loads of minus AVs. So it's interesting. There's no claw on uh, Wolfpack's team, but he doesn't really need it. <laughs> so there you go. <laughs> My chat is telling me they can hear music, which is very odd because I don't I don't have any music playing. I did have music on oh, for some reason you when you when you join games sometimes. Um, music is the carries on. The music carries on in the background sometimes. Don't know why. <laughs> Cheeky removal because of the armor seven. A straight cars too. <laughs> yep, cars. Yeah, not even removal cars because of the. It, yeah. <laughs> it would have been a KO anyway. <laughs> Immediately getting punished for having an AV pass. Yep. <laughs> KO. Yeah, there was music. Yeah, it, it's just sometimes when going from the menu screen to, to what spectator game, the music continues. Don't know why. If someone can identify the music, um, that'll be good, Chimp. I've got literally nothing playing in the background. So I've got no idea. It's a girl. Not helpful. <laughs> right. It's not on mine anyway. <laughs> Sinai code has also got expelled from coding class. <laughs> Interesting. That's not a bad turn, is it, from Wolfbar? No, that was pretty good. So I'm just trying to find out whether or not there's actually music playing anyway. <laughs> If it's super faint, are you sure it's not coming from my like, gym? <laughs> it's definitely not coming from me. I would never listen to shit like that. <laughs> <laughs> if it was Kylie or uh, Steps, maybe. <laughs> Right, sorry, sorry, chat. Uh, I got no clue. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Ooh, huge, huge Kaz. That's his. That's, that's the guy he bought. Yep, I would have appled that. See, with my power apple that I would have induced, not a fucking bribe. <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh, he's eating it. He's That's eaten. pretty massive as a re as a return removal. Yeah. That's more important than the guard that Cyber Knight lost. Yes. Yes, Chorfs are more important than uh, Bert. <laughs> uh, I think Jim was playing it. I was not playing any music. Oh, what were you playing? <laughs> I had you were, I had the you menu. Some music. kind of daughter based game, weren't you? Oh, I was. Oh, sorry. I thought you turned on the music still. Um, yeah, the Dota, Dota Underworlds. I don't understand it at all yet. 
I joined a game with uh, just a random person and Ducky, and they were first and second, obviously. <laughs> <laughs> with a bunch of random people. But um, I've got no idea. <laughs> yes, Rogue Shenanigans. At some point, we'll talk about the game and not Dota and whether or not I'm playing music. <laughs> he's gone quite far over this side, hasn't he, to, to make that hit and protect his guy. I think he's maybe gone too far over that side. But um, looks like Wolfbar yeah. is not really pushing forward like he maybe could have done. He could have staked out the right-hand side here, couldn't he? Yeah, I but, think I would have um, wanted a, a bit of a bulwark. <laughs> he might be doing it here. He might do, yeah. He does a palm. Yes, but uh, that he can't palm. I guess he can't palm the guy that he's just tagged. No, he can't. No, no. <laughs> so that's not the best. And he does have a stand firm, so he can potentially palm um, peasants at some point. <laughs> I assume he's going to blitz with the with the uh, the bull. Oh no, he's blitzing with this guy. Okay. Get fended. <laughs> yes, not that he would have followed into a mind blow punch back, but no, but still, get fended. <laughs> Every time Fen pops up, it's like yes, get fended. <laughs> Block is a very good skill. Yes, I guess he's kind of a bit worried about the wizard as well, isn't he? So it's, it's fair enough. Is he going to foul that peasant? No. A well, lot he's, of got, guys he's, got a, he's got a bribe, so why not? Peasant. Ducky probably would. <laughs> <laughs> Genuinely the worst player on the pitch right now. Imagine using the bribe on that. <laughs> he's not doing it. So he's, he, <laughs> he's offered up this this front chorf. Yes. <laughs> it's like, please punch me. Yes, rather. But he can still just hit the uh he can hit this one safely anyway, can't he? The uh Ceres, is it? He could hit the bull. He could hit the bull. The, guy, the guys have Dauntless. Yeah. Well they've got strength four as well, but you'd want to hit with a mighty blow, don't the you? Mighty really? blow one, yeah. Could have gone straight in and just punched a bull. Could have done. Going in. Maybe he's. No, I don't understand. <laughs> don't understand what he's doing. He's just going in. And so I think that's what he's doing. He's just going in. He's going in. They <laughs> are really a team. Elf, yes. They're actually... They're not as bad as we all make out. They're, they're pretty good at low TV. Like, they're, they're probably tier one at low TV. And then they just get worse, is the thing. Unless you roll a shitload of stats, which Cyber does. Isn't that weird? I don't get that. That was it, yeah. I don't know what happened there. I don't like that. No, I don't like it. Now his mighty blow guy is stuck. Well, Skuro, to answer your question, has Cyber won the finals? He plays ogres and brats. <laughs> <laughs> he is not, uh, Skuro. But you know, he's in the final. Brats, and he could win. He's, he's probably got the better team here, even though that's not he Hasn't he got to the final before? Uh, he, no, I don't think he, he had a good. He had a good team before. I don't think he got the final before. Mm, let me look. Brett's our remotely win team, yeah, that's true. It's ridiculous. One time they diced the living shit out of Ducky, and the other time Ducky won. So there you go. Did get there one season now, fair enough. I disagree, Shattered Eyes. I don't think they'd be a better use of startups, I think. There we go, yeah, he lost to Pupox Nurgle. As Brett's in season 16. No, see, that guy that he didn't have to stand up just died. Yep. 
Like standing him up literally did nothing there, other no than problem. getting cast. Getting punched because he, he could have he could have blitzed he could have blitzed this guard from this direction, and then the push would have cleared the other guy away. So then he could have been free. But I, I hated what he did with his getting in here, and he paid for it with a paid for it with a cast. So that's fair, isn't it? Yes. <laughs> it's nice to see the game agreeing with us. <laughs> <laughs> this was shit. You die. <laughs> That's true. Yes, Rog Channing is. I am the best Brits coach ever. It's a true fact. <laughs> this is yeah. It's definitely Wolfbach's uh, first final. In fact, I don't think he got he got to quarters once before. Brits are proper. And uh, without being, it's not meant to be mean because they both played well. Um, they've both had miracle draws, really. Yeah. Like Wolfbach's team is mediocre, and he got put in a really easy bracket for his team yeah. no claw no nothing until the semis where Valahopia played weirdly and uh, Wolfbark beat him and then um, Cyber avoided us all yeah. <laughs> Jim got beat I got beat <laughs> Crucifer got beat yeah. Cyber was in the, the worst part of the bracket and just <laughs> the rest of us got twatted <laughs> miracle draw like playing versus goblins <laughs> yeah like the dream first round by of getting goblins, imagine that. Seventy five percent armor goblins. They're quite good at that point. No, they're not. <laughs> they fucking are. No, it's still on the pitch. <laughs> and I wasn't. <laughs> oh dear me. Um, but yeah. Oh, he's going for the. He's going all in on the pal here. He gets it. Look at dog. Yeah. Oh, good lord. Oh, this is bad. Oh. That's an apo. Yeah, it's it a straight. Apple, yeah. That's not. That's a non-thinking apo. Yep. Well, there we go. Wolfbox having the best of these. Uh, these block dice, three cars in three turns. Yeah, it's pretty good. Is he going to 1D with this? 1D the peasant, the dirty player? Make, probably makes sense to 1D him. I guess it does leave the ball a bit exposed, so he didn't, he didn't go for it. Yeah, yeah, Skira, I do remember that. I didn't lose, though, did I? <laughs> 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 Jumpy Jim had the ball on, in my, like about four squares from my end zone. He had it in his hand, four squares from my end zone, and winning 2 1 on turn 14. <laughs> and then he lost 3 2. <laughs> wow. <laughs> um, Wolfbark was the underdog elf, and he took a guard chorf, because he was missing a chorf, who is now dead, and a bribe. And they both get a wizard because it's a wizard stadium. Cyber Knight brought a whole new stadium for the finals. Yes. <laughs> Frenzy fail. Uh, what is he's got? He's to be fair, he's appalled one of the cars. One of the cars is completely irrelevant. The other cars isn't that bad. So it, it's just bad for the drive, but not bad for the game. He's got reserves, so it's it's not that bad. The two cars. Um, uh, the the guard one's an annoyance. The other guy, yeah, he's got a replacement for. But for this drive, being he's now two men down. Yeah. It's gonna be it's gonna be difficult to stop the score. Yeah, it's bad for this drive, and it, you know it's bad. Obviously, that his apples go. Absolutely taught. We welcome shitters in this channel. <laughs> Normally they're the people just destroying me game after game. <laughs> We've got fame, good question. Oh, there we go. Gets the removal back. Yeah. Exposed Targeted Hobgoblin. The and Ex that's what got the removal. Yep, exposed Hobgoblin removed. For great justice. <laughs> it's pretty good, isn't it, so far? Mm. <laughs> Things are working as they should. Yeah, unbelievable. It is zero fame on either side. Yeah, no one has the fame. Uh, the prediction 
is uh, Wolfpark is slight favourite for me, Elf. I would say Cyber Knight is slight favourite for me. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> no, notice we put both put slight, didn't they? So. It did swing back once uh, after that first Kaz by Cyber Knight. I thought he went back to slight favorite, but in return, Wolfbug has done two more Kaz. So mm. for me, he's back to slight favorite. Slight favorite. Just because of the armor breaks, I think are going to be punished by the Mighty Blow. Yeah, he's got a lot of Mighty Blow. But then, but then you know, Cyber Knight's got movement and like he's got better equipped to take advantage of a wizard, I think. Yes, yeah, that's that's the thing that makes me just say slight favorite. So if Cyber Knight's wizard goes off um, at the right time, he can do something with it. Wolfbark probably can't. Yeah, it's not, I mean, you know, he's still got bulls, which is which are all right, aren't they? Bodge break tackle, um, break tackle. So yeah, but they're not they're not taking the ball. Like it's, one of them's even add one. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but you know, you can still do things with a wizard. But yeah, it's it's obviously much better for a. Uh, Cyber Knight. He doesn't have any edge four though, does he? He is jammed in against the side here now, and yeah. uh, Cyber does have that frenzy guy. Yep. To do things with. Yep. This is a surf chaff at the moment. Don't know how he can stop it. Apart from just being lucky. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there we go. That's how he. That's how he stops it. Just lucky. The classic. The classic blood ball tactic of being lucky is is pretty good. Birds have won the CCL twice, Andrew. Yes, uh, but in early days when not all the teams were in, and there were weird rules. <laughs> I don't think. But I don't think Birds have won since we've changed to this like one of every race and eight wild card thing. Oh, I don't know. Maybe not. I remember Ducky should have smashed him. Ducky had orcs and it just got diced to absolute death. That might have been with the proper the proper rules, if you like. <laughs> oh, getting right in there with a the guard. He's got the push. There we go. Oh, he could surf. He could surf the uh, bull, couldn't he? Yes. If he, if he wanted to uh, get fruity. I think he'll just go for the surf on the. The chorf, but yeah, he could surf the bull if he really wanted to. Yeah, if he powered him, I think that was his idea, right? If he powered him, he could have uh, brought in the sidestepper there and he would have surfed the bull. Yeah. So a bit unlucky not to get the power. I mean, it's one dice. Yeah. It's a one in but, one. Yeah. If he does this, which is shit. Would it but to surf the bull, it'd be pretty cool. Yeah, it would have been a two and a two if he got the power, wouldn't it? Which would have been amazing. So huge non power there. Maybe you should have re-rolled it with four re-rolls eh? Yeah, maybe. Arguable. Guess what was... He does give up a lot if that second re-roll is shit, though, isn't it? Yeah, of course, yeah. <laughs> he gets a one in nine or a dub skulls. So he's yeah. fucked. I'm not saying you should have re-rolled it, but, you know, maybe, maybe. Would have been... Oh, he is going for it. He's going for the 1D. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Dirty dog. Guess a fucking straight pow instead. <laughs> well, this is now interesting. Yeah. Oh, that's a great, great spot for the guard, isn't it? Generating two two dice blocks. He's unlikely to get surfed, Rogue Shenanigans. Well, he might reroll this one. <laughs> oh, and he did! <laughs> what did I say? <laughs> oh, glorious! Yeah, the I thing is, I like the re-roll there as well. I wouldn't have re-rolled it because you're getting the uh, you're getting the second hit as well, aren't you? Off the dirty player guy, but um, his peasant might get surfed. He, he, the other guy's got sidestep, so he ain't gonna get surfed. I think what? he's just thinking. I've got I've got four re-rolls. This guy being on the floor is much better than. Mm being either free or tagging my blocker for a mighty blow hit back, but yeah. Oh yeah, I mean, I understand why he did it, but um, he did have the he did have the peasant hit to come on, didn't he? 
That's a shame. That that turn could have been amazing for Cyber and ended up being a bit shit. Yeah, yeah. If he powered that dwarf, he could have surfed the ball, and then uh, and he he could have not he could have not dub skulled. <laughs> yes, he could have not rolled a dub skull. Now yeah. now he's weak in the middle. Yeah, yeah. Roshan, I think he probably should have just taken the dwarf surf when he didn't get the power. Yeah, yeah. It was pretty greedy, just not going, not just taking that. But on the other hand, the, putting the ball down does kind of protect him and get him. You know, it's better positionally so it's pretty good it, it, it hard to say that it was wrong it's not critical but it's not great um it allows uh wolfbark to, to switch sides with four turns to go really and he was jammed in against the side whereas now he's not going to be so much like wolfbark was in a bad position there i thought and now that dub skulls has kind of allowed him to get out of it. Oh, hello. Yeah. Fouling the dirty player. Yep. Nope, and there's a removal. removal as well. It's See, getting... this is all coming from the dubs. Yeah, it's getting a bit shit for him now. I think you'll find he was a lot more critical than he thought, Necro. Yeah, I think I would have taken the 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 two dice surf over the one dice cheeky surf. I think it, even I and I'm rowdy when I play <laughs> wouldn't have gone for that. Yeah, but it still protects the the peasant and the and the and the blocker there. So like it was, it was pretty good. Getting that power was was probably better than surfing the chaff. To be fair. Because this job ain't doing shit now. And this bull ain't doing shit. And this other guy ain't doing, you know, shit either. So he's taking three players out here. Whereas if he'd surfed that guy, the bull could have hit the uh, peasant. And, okay, this guy would have still been fucked. Or this guy could have one deed the peasant and then the bull could have been free. Wait, he's not. He's not fouling the dirty player. Right, Classic, gone Jim to stun. <laughs> Classic Jim Fowl sent off for a stun. Glorious. Wait, who's he hitting? I can't tell who he's hitting. Oh, there we go. Right, he was hitting him. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, he's got that guard there. Ah, oh, he was trying to. He's trying to chain the bull out. I think. Yes. Yeah. Ah, done oh. it anyway. Look at dog <laughs> rolls the five plus. Didn't even didn't even need break tackle. Now he can do the second one if he wants, can't he? Yep. Fucker. <laughs> That's the kind of shit that sets me off when I'm playing. Like, <laughs> fuck off. That's fair. Like, I don't mind him break tackling today, but not using break tackle. <laughs> fuck off. <laughs> oh, that's fine, that unless you shouldn't be bothered about that. One in three, it's not bad. Well, the peasant can't hit the ball, can he? I mean, he's got blodge, so he can uphill him. He could think about fireballing or something, I guess, because he's got this dodger there and he's got this, but... It's not really a good spot for a wizard, I don't think, but... No, no, Nasha, we're not brothers. <laughs> Weird question. <laughs> <laughs> do we sound like we're brothers? <laughs> we do not have remotely the same accents. No, I haven't even been. I haven't been doing my dreadful, my dreadful attempt of an accent either. <laughs> if you had, he definitely wouldn't think we were brothers. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Bloody hell! <laughs> I'm from the valleys. <laughs> you go. <laughs> Oh, it's an okay stun. Freeze up the other guy as well. Yeah. Yeah, I think now he might just surf the, the chaff, because otherwise the chaff's taken two players up, isn't he? So I reckon yeah. you surf the chaff this turn and uh, maybe even blitz him to just get shit over the right side. Yeah, to move the guy who's going to surf him away from the edge. Well, he's yeah, he's got he's got sidestep, but the main thing is to just get him into the mix, isn't it? He's got to 
try and stop the score. Is he going to dodge? Probably. There's no point in standing there to get punched, is there? Yeah, he's probably got to just to try and get over the other side so that he can try and stop the skull. Yeah, Vulpies, I, I don't know. It's, it's tough, isn't it? I'm just not reading. I do like, in this case, I do like standing him up because it means one of those two guys is not moving. Yeah. Oh, yeah, he had to stand up, the dirty player there, yeah, for sure. When in doubt, root for not short. Yeah, that's a good point. That's a good point. Cyber Knight has managed to take glorious birds to the final. So for that, he should Yeah, be... I, th I think if we're going for, like, the popular vote, definitely Brett's. Yeah. <laughs> Other guys are people. No offence to Wolfbark, but uh, he's got chorfs, so... Yeah. And I say that as a chorf coach. <laughs> I think this was maybe a, an overcommit by Cyber Knight here. Over, like, you know, he wanted that stuff to over the right, but there's only a bull out in front of the right, and his main men are through the middle, and he's just going to go through the middle here, isn't he? Rot all. But I guess he's got lots avail lots available for the wizard now though, I guess. Maybe he's gonna maybe he's gonna um maybe he's gonna go for the wizard this turn, eh? He could that do. I mean if he, he's gonna blitz true. the the hater does not support your assertion. The block guard peasant, I guess, and try and Yeah. Because it's too dangerous to blitz the sidesteppers, isn't it? But it means that's just a perfect X cage fireball. Yeah. Got strength four right there, guard right there. Everyone's free to react. Yeah, this is this is absolute dream fireball position now. And I mean, if this isn't a power, it's even better. Like if it, if it's a one in nine. Yeah. Uh, Cyber Knight is the guy who's got top vampires this season, Nasha. Yes, quite a good quite a good team too. So he's probably going to take it instead of Burt's. Mm -hmm. Oh. No, I mean, that's the thing. It's not, it's not a criticism of Wolfpack, is it? It's probably what I'd do, but then I'd think, like, oh, shit. <laughs> I'll do it. You know, maybe the mistakes were made previously. Hard to say, isn't it? It's hard to say what anyone should have done. But, yeah, he's certainly in a, in a tricky spot. Still got another dodge if he wants it. Doesn't get stunned as well. Mm. Okay, I've rolled another five. That, that dude is the dodgiest elf <laughs> like <laughs> bull ever. Doesn't take it. It's got, he's got a fireball this, hasn't he? I think he certainly might. I don't know if he's got to, but I think he might. I mean, that this is, this is the dream of... Because he's got a bunch of players to, like, yeah. recover and shit. I mean, oh, the ball carriers resisted. Oh, 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 sick, sick, uh, six, sick knockdowns. Actually, that's pretty good. It's pretty good. That's, yeah, it? it's pretty good. If the ball carrier had gone down as well, that would be the absolute dream. But, <laughs> yeah. but like either of the, it wasn't that good a fireball because the the bull or the hobgob going down weren't so good. But he got both of the ones that going down were good. So yeah, here we go. Got him, and it's out to the good side. Yeah. Huge scatter now. And removal. He's killed him as well. He's ruined Uranus. Oh, he's up on it. <laughs> and the dream scatter. Oh, baby. He can pick up with a, with a wrestler, can't he, and then hand off to, to him and then fuck off. Pick up with shoe hands standing right next to it. Oh, he's got shoe hands right next to it. <laughs> well, that's pretty good then, isn't it? Yep, <laughs> it's not terrible. I didn't know he had shoe hands. That's why I thought the, the catch is actually quite good, isn't it? Because they got catch. But yeah, with shoe hands, obviously, you just. He's also got two uh, two dice into two dice on the bull. Yes. Yes. 
yes, he should get this other this other blocker over the, over where the bull is, shouldn't he? Oh, this is pretty good. He's probably better off not punching the bulls because they're pretty tied up where they are. No, I mean the the one bull at the back's got a two plus escape. Yeah, well, I mean, I would have moved it. I would have moved the wrestler. Oh, in he's there. one in nine. Oh no! Like if you move the wrestler in there, then they're pretty they're pretty oh, corralled. Oh my god! He has oh, one shit. in fucking nine. Could have eaten that one in nine by hitting the bull. Yeah. <laughs> Sucker! Irrelevant block first would have saved you there. Yes, I don't think that was the play though. I think the play was to bring the uh, bring the blocker into the, into the bulls because then it, it's it's controlling them. They're surrounded by like garden strength four then, aren't they? And then whereas now because he's failed that this guy the the blocker is just shit. He's just standing there like a dickhead. He is a scoring threat to be fair, but he is just standing there like a dickhead. Whereas at least if you moved him first, you would have had the the bulls. Rather, I, th I think the idea was to stop the return wizard, right? Get another guy down there so you can't just bolt. Because nice. the the guy the guy with shoe hands is armor seven. Nah, yes, you read on him bolt. Yeah. See, but now he's got this two plus out, which sucks, doesn't it? He would have not had that had he um, had, had he covered. He had he have covered, yeah. Uh, I do, Nasha. We don't sound alike. <laughs> you are insane. Get your ears checked. <laughs> Unbelievable. <laughs> Nasha, you need to uh, get your ears checked. <laughs> <laughs> oh! Dodge to foul. It's disgusting, isn't it? That's not glorious. Doesn't. Doesn't get the armor break. <laughs> Boyo. <laughs> <laughs> the boyo's essential. The boyo's essential because if you don't say boyo, how are they meant to know? It's, <laughs> it's like all yeah, the. If you don't say boyo, it's basically just a Pakistani accent. Yeah, it's like all these shit fucking shitheads on Britain's Got Talent where they come in and they do like some awful ac like awful impression, but they like say. They, they always like explain it first so that everyone understands, don't they? They don't just like do like like a good impressionist would just do an impression of somebody. And from what they were saying, you'd know who they were, wouldn't you? But instead, they like go, you know, like they go, I don't know, fucking Michael Caine walks into a bookshop, <laughs> and then they do their shit voice. <laughs> so Boyo's the, the equivalent of that. <laughs> right. So here, I take the block on the stand firm chalk with the frenzy guy, because my next play would be to one dice the blodge ball. I would not be dodging first action. I think we've got to try and get the ball, haven't you? Like you want to. I think you well, want to. If you if you one dice the blodge ball, you free up the the, the block guard. He's blodge though. You only need to push. To free oh, up the block so you hit him with yeah, hit him with the wrestler and then free up the the uh, line or yeah, could have run him round, punched that off. Yeah. Yeah, I don't hear you. Now he hasn't. I mean, he could still do it now anyway. Yeah. But he hasn't got a reroll. Yeah. Yeah, I guess actually just trying to stop the score should have been priority number one, shouldn't it? And now he's got a GFI, hasn't he? If he wants to get this hit. I mean, he might as well GFI run to the 1D. Because then you've got a blotchy sidestepper strength 4 near the ball. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Ah, there's a 1 anyway. Yeah, to be fair, if he'd rolled there the plow on that hobgoblin, he'd have been in a really good spot, wouldn't he? So, but the ball is now completely open. Yeah, it's a seventy-five percent pickup. Like I, that, that's the problem. Like the failure state of what he did, I didn't like at all. Yeah, well, seventy-five percent score, isn't it? Yeah, I, I wouldn't even do uh, anything. I am, I am Nasha. Yes, absolutely. Guy. Yes, rogue shenanigans. Cyber since the wizard has just had garbage dice, and now has just been cast as well. Yeah. 
There and he's go. just picked up without even a reroll. Yeah. He fails the one in nine, he makes the 50 50. Ouch. Yeah. Pretty disgusting. Uh, yeah. Well, now with those extra cars, I think Wolfpark is more than a slight favorite. Yeah, the wizard's gone. The Cyber doesn't have the wizard. Wolfpark still does. Wolfpark's got four cars to one in the first half. It's still 11 men, though, for Cyber Knight. Yeah, but they're a bunch of shitters now. <laughs> hey, I'll have you know, peasants are the uh, the best linemen for uh, according to a lot of people on Reddit. <laughs> Which guarantees that they're shit. <laughs> you said it. I did. <laughs> I'm totally fine with it. Come get me, Reddit. No, I'm, and I agree, hundred percent. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> There's a lot. I just don't know why they give advice, you know. I wouldn't go around giving people advice on, like, you know, Fortnite or Call of Duty or, uh, you know, fucking <laughs> anything other than Blood Bowl. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I think he really paid for not moving the uh, the guard over. But yeah, you know, at the end of the day, that that was just the safer play, wasn't it? It wasn't his play was better if he picked it up eight times out of nine. His play was arguably, but even then, I still like putting the guard there anyway because it would have kept the balls out the way. So I still liked it, even if he made the pick up moving the guard. But then the guard is obviously even better if you want in nine. Yeah, I really, I really like taking the one dice first rather than the dodge because it, he had wrestle, um, so and a push was fine. So it's basically a two plus instead of a three plus. Um, so I really like doing that first. And yeah, had he done that first, the two that he rolled would have actually been good. I think by then he was, he was up shit creek. Oh, he's gone for the one turn. No, I mean as as the literal first action. Yeah, Just yeah. First but I action, think, I would have won dice. But I think by then, I think he was up shit creek. You know, I think the main thing was not moving the guard in before and rolling the one in nine was horrible, wasn't it? Eight times out of nine, he gets that ball and he fucks off. Yes, yeah. Well, the the previous turn was just garbage. I don't hate that he rolled run, run another guy down just because I like I said, it, the ball carrier's armor seven. <clears> he was worried about the return bolt just killing him and mm -hmm. therefore stopping the scores back. But uh, yeah, yeah, I didn't. I mean, with both with both wizards gone. And the ball and Wolfbark not scoring, yes, then you, you still take that, wouldn't you? So, yeah, exactly. Yeah, so I wouldn't have cared if he'd fall. So. Maybe he was more worried because of um, the fact that his apple had gone. Yeah, maybe. Um, <laughs> the Versailles, treat your Versailles, no idea, no clicker heroes, but I could give Chris's The Lost Idols advice and uh, Idol Heroes advice actually. So, there's two, there's three games I can give advice on. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's, it's bad dice continues there, eh? because that was pretty hilarious. Yep, horrific. Uh, Cyber Knight's getting a little bit diced, Cree. Um, not, a, not a crazy dice in, but everything important that he's tried has gone wrong. It is a, it is just a straight best of one game lip. Yeah, the Champions Cup is just straight one game knockout. Peasants should be like Adj one with no hands. <laughs> <laughs> no hands. <laughs> just literally chop their hands off. Yeah, uh, the Brecks don't let the filthy commoners touch the ball. <laughs> the weirdest thing to have no hands is the fucking death roller. There's a dwarf sat on it using his hands. <laughs> like you could easily just have the ball in his lap. <laughs> yep. Yes, Cree. 
That is that is true, Cree. I mean, no, Brett's we like shit. Play, we do like to play uphill with the the hardest team. Brett's a shit, and Chops are the best team. So, <laughs> that's uh, it. The other one is Artemis Black Deadlights. We do not sound similar. <laughs> <laughs> that's correct. <laughs> That'd be great. That'd be great if. That'd be great. <laughs> that'd be great if. If once the peasants touch the ball, the knights will, will refuse to touch the ball for the rest of the match. <laughs> or, yeah. or until a touchdown scored. Until a touch. Until a touchdown score of the drive ends. Or until a half ends. That'd be great. That wouldn't. It? There was. Um, that's that was the thing that someone took in the one minute league as a. Uh, as a handicap. Yeah. It was all peasants and one blitzer, and only the blitzer was allowed to touch the ball. Yeah, pretty good. Yeah, but they'd still, they'd still touch the ball, though, Roche Nelligans. They, they, knights do look down on blockers, but they'd still touch the ball. You know. Uranus! Uranus oh, has been ravaged no. by a rock! You never want Uranus to suffer an injury. <laughs> brutal. Uranus has been brutalized. A, a rock in Uranus is bad times. <laughs> Isn't it, Joe? Fucking hell. Yeah, it was a bit late, wasn't it, the KO? I didn't think it. I thought that was a bad apple. But then, on the other hand, he might not have come back, so... <laughs> Simply cannot protect Uranus. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. So that's swung back a bit for Cyber, hasn't it? They do, yeah, they do, do. The crowd just deciding to go straight for Uranus. <laughs> Can't blame them for that. Some shit block dice here, typical versus fucking chores. <laughs> and he once again he's put his fucking frenzy dude to take a block. Cyber doesn't care about frenzy traps ever. Yeah, well, I mean to be fair, he hit the other two guys first, didn't he? And he was hoping he would do better than just bolt down, bolt down, push, which rookie rookie mistake really. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Set, setting up expecting uh, things to go well. Yeah. That's why I hate the bribe, you know. That's why I probably hate the bribe. Basically did nothing for him. Whereas an apple would have either appled that KO or appled that blocker. Oh, there you go. It got away with it. Yeah. Oh, double got away with it. Yeah. Followed up there as well. Guess he's blitzing the other dude. Yeah, I guess the dirty player's going to blitz. Next season, I don't know, Cream. Maybe Chorfs, just because they're the best. <laughs> just do Chorfs every season, like Artemis and Crucifer. <laughs> just to make it interesting and zigging. Jeez. Uh, we don't know if we're getting two or three minutes yet. If it's two minutes, it's not ziggy. No, yeah, true, true. And uh, High Elves and Pro Elves as well. I got High Elves set up. Yeah. My first, my first ever attempt at High Elves. Yeah. What's your starting Never roster? Before. I got I got chorfs, but weird chorfs because I'm gonna try and lev I'm gonna try and hobgoblin legend level. Yeah. So I'm gonna keep playing the same chorf team even if they do well. Right. Um, and I got lizards, vampires, and high elves. Jesus. I'm gonna go minor chorfs. Mino Chorfs. <laughs> first, ever, first ever Mino Chorf legend. Yep. <laughs> That's the one. I'd piss, it would piss Jimmy off more, I think, Cree. Jim also hates Norse. 
Oh, glorious ducky returning. Unbelievable. Wow. Unbelievable, Jeff. Chaos or good life. I do like I do like a bit of chaos. Yeah. <laughs> They're amazing. I mean you gotta suffer through the first ten games rather than that. I don't know, the first ten is when I do best. <laughs> Because at least at low TV, you don't get randomly take the insane cards. You do a high TV, do you? Oh, dude, we have the opposite fucking experience of Blood Bowl. <laughs> <laughs> I've had like 10 deaths on my low TV dwarf team already. Mm. No, I haven't no. played Claw once. No, I went like 7 2 1 first 10 games with my Chaos. And then after that, just took infinite cards and didn't do any removals with four Claw Pom. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I, four claw pommin out bashed every game. It is crazy, man. Oh, apparently Windows wants to update my computer. I tell you what, Windows, fuck off. Yeah, I should have tried not being an unlucky shitter. That's true. So, so while we said the wizard was good for Cyber Knight, he has got the absolute worst player on earth to get hit by a wizard, a strength four armor seven guy. <laughs> Blodger. Yes. Yeah. Blodge Stepper. And his leader. <laughs> yeah, leader. Blodge Step leader. Strength four. And armor seven. He's the absolute worst lightning bolt target of all time. His name's Sir Dick Hammer as well, which is quite good. <laughs> Dick Hammer Fist. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> he'll, be, he'll be deep in your anus. <laughs> oh, flip me. That, that fucking block guard lino peasant is a star. Yeah, he's pretty strong. He has been powed like three or four times with Mighty Blow. Hasn't even taken a stun. Tooken, I said then. Haven't even taken a stun. Hasn't even taken a, took a yeah. stun. <laughs> I said Tooken. <laughs> <laughs> ah. Takes a pound in well, Elf. Yes. Uranus didn't. <laughs> Oh, oh, some punching going back the other way. Steps a guard in, he can two dice mighty blow the bull. He could. I think he'll blitz the bull and then block that guy. That makes sense, doesn't it? Probably. But that might put him a bit on the sideline, which is a bit dodgy. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, this blitzer, the, the mighty blow blitzer can't blitz the ball. Well, he could GFI, but yeah, he doesn't want to, does he? He might do it, though. I think he's just going to hit the ball with mighty blow and blitz the other guy. Maybe. Might do the GFI. You have to do the GFI. Nah, you wouldn't have put that that peasant round there if he was going to do that I don't think yeah because you need two assists don't you strength three I don't like this if he's if he does that I don't like it I mean he doesn't need two assists because he's got Dauntless so. oh yeah <laughs> <laughs> never goes wrong right I mean if you're going to roll a two plus anyway welcome to Blood Bowl <laughs> out of this <laughs> You absolutely need to assist when you've got Dauntless. 100% need the assist when you've got Dauntless. Alright, he did just block anyway. Ah, what a surprise. <laughs> That's an even Pelican de Kale. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, 
is he gonna foul here? Oh, maybe. Could be in desperation mode here. Could go for a foul on that guard, Chof. It's not a terrible foul. Could do. Nope, he isn't. No, he isn't. <laughs> Is it 10v10 now, is it? I think so. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. 2, 4, 6, 8. Yep, it is, yeah. Interesting. All to play for. Yeah, count it out loud as well. You're lucky you couldn't see me use my fingers like. <laughs> Just trying to fill the air like Fenian, the old thinking, watching two people think. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I played someone earlier. There's a new Dalibor. Oh no. Oh god. His average time is 91 minutes. Whoa. And he ran out of time on like four of the 16 turns. Whoa. While still having stuff to do, just literally ran out of time. Didn't run the clock out or anything. Ugh. I was, oh, I was just sitting there like, please, please let my life end. <laughs> end the turn. Like I could die right sake. now, and happier. End the fucking the turn, game. man! <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> exclamation point! End the turn, drowned you out there. <laughs> <laughs> Good. <laughs> it's perfectly appropriate. Yeah. No mighty blow, but oh no, he's got the ball. Yeah, he'd, he'd moved like half of his team at one point and he ran out of time. <laughs> two minutes. The, uh... Two minutes and 40 seconds before he moved the first guy and then was surprised that he ran out of time. Oh. Could break tackle and hit the strength four. Might do that. Four, five, six, seven, eight. No, he's not going to just gets wrestled instead yeah. it was an option I mean you know that's the thing like obviously I didn't expect Cyber Knight to go around and make the GA fight a bit of Mighty Blow but he, he could have done couldn't he you know like it was an option and he, yeah. you know Wolfbart could have could have brought tackle the way there and hit that because it is a high value player isn't it strength 4 blodge step frenzy that's a pretty good player to hit with Mighty Blow tackle so where is the shithead blocker not so much Right, so the strength four probably hits this guard mighty blow guy. Because he's got frenzy, so you can even push him away if he fails. It's two into two regardless. And then the mighty blow can hit the pommer. No, I did hit the pommer first because the pommer's got guard. Oh, the other. I didn't see the other guy up there. Is now not. Because uh, the, the bull got wrestled, he's an assist. The other peasant. Yeah. So now he can uh, two dice mighty blow the blodge bull. Get up the pitch. Yep. It does leave him a bit squashed to the sideline, but... I think yep. he can come around. If he moves the block guard guy around, then he can move the peasant around to cut off... If he gets the pow, he can move the peasant around further. Yeah, it's still just a bit... He's still a bit squeezed on the sideline, isn't he? Get to the pow. This will be a juicy removal or stun even. Or nothing, <laughs> obviously. I don't think they ever have no 4 5 on fine. No, I don't think they ever had either. They, they get told about attention them. to the World Cup. <laughs> they get vaguely told about them when they're told who to send checks to in the past. Yeah. And normally you put him on the sideline now because of the sidestep. But with a wizard, he's got to put him one square off, hasn't he? Oh, 
Oh, glorious took okay. Glorious. Nice, nice, Ducky. Early retirement from what, mate? If you don't mind, uh, like, fuck off is an acceptable answer. <laughs> yes, checks with a Q if you if you're British. Checks with a C K S if you're a Yank. Or I if guess you if you can't spell. Or I guess if you're a foreign, isn't it? You know, uh, foreigners, foreigners Randall, tend to learn other cars. American English, don't they? 10v9 now. And the thing is, uh, only one of Cyber Knights could possibly come back. Whereas yes. uh, Wolfbark has an 11th one already. <laughs> so Wolfbark is currently guaranteed 11 for any overtime or a next drive. Yep. Whereas Cyber is now not. Yeah, you know, overtime's probably Cyber Knight's best, best fucking prospect now, isn't it? Best case scenario for him is, is overtime. Like he's unlikely to get the try for a two one in normal time. Foreigners don't exist. <laughs> it's crazy because you like it's crazy because all of the European people who were involved in Blood Bowl tend to just write perfect English anyway. So you could not even know that they wouldn't even know they weren't English. Like wouldn't know that English wasn't their native. Language. Yeah, more most mainstream. European countries, you know, outside of like Eastern European and stuff, uh, all speak impeccable English. Yeah, and type it, type type better than you know, write write and write it just better than. But a lot of them write it better than English people do, don't they? Because they learn the grammar, whereas we tend to not learn the grammar in England. <laughs> Thanks for the follow, Randall Maximus. <laughs> the retirement from getting diced in Blood Bowl. American English fireman. That's that's why the world speaks English because of Americans. There's no such thing as Brit English fireman. There's English, <laughs> and then there's American English, which is basically wrong. Yeah, yeah that's a good point, Scurry. It is like when when a Frenchman watches me streaming, they think he must be a natural French speaker. Otherwise, how could he say "poule poule ragu"? Zip bon bebu. Have you seen the episode of Friends where Joey is speaking French? Yes, someone linked it, and I was like, "Yeah, it's pretty good." <laughs> yep, that, that is it. It's spot, <laughs> spot on impersonation. <laughs> Not impersonation. We're just both perfect at speaking French. Yeah, I mean, he could score here, couldn't he? But he's four turns to back. It's pretty rough, isn't he? Yeah, exactly. I don't think he has. I mean, it, if he powers this ball, like, he definitely doesn't have to. Yeah. Well, I'm not saying he has to, but he could. <laughs> <laughs> he could. I think he has to dauntless power the ball. Yeah. Can't afford anyone else. No, he can't really. No. Gets it both. Don't listen and the pow. Lovely words. Guess frenzy guy blitzes. Oh, he blitzed. Yeah, he blitzed the move. Mm, interesting. I think, I think he's going to dodge with, with the guy on the floor. I think I would blitz with frenzy guy. I'll blitz with him. Mm, uh, yeah, if he, I guess if he stands up the guy on the floor, he can hit the other chorf. I mean, otherwise, this strength four guy is just standing there. Yeah. I think yeah, it's got to hit him. There we go. He gets a pow. It's quite a nice one, too. The second one rather than the first. He's in a better position now. Oh, he's made the dodge. He has indeed. And the cheeky wandy. Throws the cheeky one. -er. Probably going to throw the other one in that case then. Yeah. 
Yeah, and he gets the pow. No, no, neither so I mean, the thing is, though, Volk is, um, he had the uh, Frenzy, didn't he, so he couldn't... Uh, Cyber Knight had the strength for Frenzy, so it was hard for Wolfbart to really shut down the sidelines. I think what he wanted him to push down a bit and then bolt him or fireball him, but he was a bit pressed on, but it wasn't, it wasn't that. He wasn't jammed against the sideline, was he? If he'd been jammed against the sideline, he could have bolted or fireballed or whatever, but he was just pushed close a blip to the sideline. It wasn't really horrible for him. You could say he was one in nine away from a win, Rogue Shenanigans, but to be fair, to get that one in nine, he did get a he did get the perfect fireball from that. Well, the perfect fireball would have taken down the ball carry as well, but like the two that he took down of the five were the ones he wanted to take down. Yeah. If he did, if he just said you can take two of these players down for your fireball, that's what he'd have picked. Yeah. What's the strategic choice for what turn to bolt the ball? It's interesting, isn't it? I mean, you generally want to uh, use it to turn over and score, but obviously Wolfbart being 1-0 up, he just has to stop the score with his fireball or bolt, which I, is why I he don't might have done it last turn. I think now he, it, uh, it's, the, the you know, the, probably the opportunity's gone this drive for him to use it, so he'll save it for overtime. Yeah, I think he'll just keep it. He's going to be man up for overtime minimum. Mm-hmm. But if he if he had been pushed more to the sideline, maybe he could have used it then. Man, I don't think we've got enough pressure on this turn. No, definitely not. Another turn of stall. I mean, he's jammed that strength four guy in. Yeah. But at the end of the day, it's just not not enough, is it? Because he's got he's got great tackle, but he can, uh, he can ooh, oh, kill the guy. Oh, oh. oh, he's dead. That would have killed anything. Wow. Yeah. Well, nine anything nine. he could knock down with a one in nine, so probably only a hop goblin or <laughs> a tree, <laughs> a tree man if he had one. Well, now Wolfbark's not guaranteed um, 11 men. He needs a KO back. Oh, good luck in the future, Ducky. I've heard he's got he's got loads of babes, yeah, Rogue Shanigans are like they're like big dick player, he plays Chaucer in Champs Ladder. And all the ladies love cool Wolfbark. <laughs> oh that's pretty shit for uh for Cyber again. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, really wanted to free that guy up. Oh yeah, then uh, then good luck, Duck. Um I assume you mean like a state retirement or something then. But yeah. Hope to see you around more. And this is enough for another st turn of stall, isn't it? It's just oh, definitely. Not, it's just not particularly nice. <laughs> it could have it could have been a lot better for him. But it's still good enough. Yeah, well, I mean, Bretts have got loads of block and wrestle, haven't they? And Chaucer have got loads of block, so it's not really like, you know, neither of them want to push it, do they, in overtime? Simon Knight would have used them if he had to. Because he, he might have had to protect the ball. I don't think Wolfbark was going to really use them. Unless he had a real shot at winning right there. And then Scott's use eye. 
Yeah, well, I mean, I'm, I'm nearly Scottish, aren't I? Just south. Hadrian's Wall as well, isn't it? Very close uh, to he where might, I live. He might have to, Impetuous Lad, yeah. There's going to be more pressure for certain. Plus, yeah, it stops any weird attempt at a turn. <laughs> 15 wizard from Wolfbark, but I don't I don't think Wolfbark would do that anyway. No. Say <laughs> south of the wall. <laughs> Boom! Oh, there's a big KO. Fantastic sound of the chaff pile on that everyone loves so much. <laughs> Next time you see a dwarf uh, pile on, by the way, uh, take a look at his face. It's hilarious. <laughs> Right. They they literally look dead eyed directly into camera. <laughs> okay. No, like they just look directly straight into your soul while just dive into one side like it was a day at the office. <laughs> Brilliant. You'll never unsee it once you see it. It's nuts. <laughs> In particular, there's one of the blitzer heads has like these yellow like Alcoholic thousand yard stare eyes. <laughs> yeah, now he's probably going to have to stall, but maybe not. But probably will. It's, bit, it's the one where if there wasn't overtime, he'd use a he'd use a reroll to stall. But he doesn't really want probably want to use a reroll, does he? Probably take his chances on stopping the two turn. Make sure he gets the tuddy. Don't like that. Don't like blocking. Don't like blocking unless he's going to stall. I think he's going to stall then. I mean, he can stall. He has to dodge, though, which requires a reroll. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, it's uh, Golden Goal or Sudden Death or whatever you want to call it, uh, Lip. Uh, it's another coin toss. Um, so normally whoever gets the ball tends to win. Um, and then first person to score wins. If it gets to, yeah, if nobody scores in the overtime half, it goes to kicks, which is basically a D6 plus one plus your... Um, number of re-rolls you got left. No, D6 minus one plus the number of re-rolls you got <laughs> left. Sorry. Yes, another eight turns. Look. Another half, essentially. Yeah. Yes, Valley, that's what he was going to do. Yeah, because yeah. yeah. if he puts the uh, ball, he could have won in nine, couldn't he? So, yeah. yeah. It's a weird diving pause they do, isn't they, when they score? Well, chance for Wolfbark here. He may commit two re-rolls and the wizard to score him. And if it just gets the win, it gets the win. So it'll be interesting yeah, to see. Mean... And Cyber doesn't get any of his KOs back. And neither does Wolfbark. <laughs> hey! <laughs> so, no KOs for anyone. Hurts Cyber a bit more, but still. It's fair, I suppose. Yeah. It hurts, uh, it hurts. Wolfbark a lot, seeing as that's his edge four ball carrier. Oh yeah, his ball <laughs> carrier's <scoring> out. <laughs> yeah, his ball carrier's out. So ten versus eight. Yep. And a bunch of mighty blow hits incoming. Yep. It was the ball carrier that got rocked. Uranus, Uranus got destroyed by a rock thrown from the crowd. Yeah, the crowd fucked up Uranus. <laughs> there we go. Ducky's seen it. Yeah, it's nuts, isn't it? <laughs> they literally just... It's that they stare into camera is the creepiest part.
Yeah, he had used his app on Uranus in the first half, yeah. Because he thought he wanted to protect Uranus, made sure he had it available for the second half. <laughs> 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 he wanted to make sure he had Uranus available for second half. He, he did really want Uranus. <laughs> Wolfbark's a massive fan of Uranus. <laughs> Didn't even see what that what that thing was. What was the thing? Changing weather. No one cares. It's a, it's a shame he's not playing Space Cadet in his anal dwarf. <laughs> anal dwarf. Do you remember they had a dwarf called Anal? <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, I do, yeah. <laughs> yeah I do. Didn't even name it. Apparently the game decided that Anal was a great name for a dwarf. Yeah, yeah, I remember that, yeah. <laughs> I think you should have blitzed first. TBH. Because if that's a push, it stops him running through. I, what I would do is... <laughs> run through, blitz this one. And then block this guy and then hand off to the bull. The other bull and then, you know, you've got a bit of a cage run, haven't you? I think that was the play. Because now he could have fucked it up with pushes. Yeah. Yeah, the chor the chorf pylon is always from a different angle than the dwarf one, and they've got helmets on as well. So, oh, there's the third KO. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Thanks for that, Nash. <laughs> I think. <laughs> I mean, Wolfbox free to just go for it. Yeah, Cyber Knight can't score back or anything. So, yeah, like marking him with him. Peasant, dirty player, peasant marked by the guard blocker, and then left hand side bull blitzes, and then go for the hand off the right hand side bull. That's what I'd go for. No, oh, but this one's got mighty blow. Oh, okay. So yeah. <laughs> this way he gets a mighty blow hit. No, oh, I don't like blitzing him though. You've already based him. Yeah, and he's sidestep. Side step, yeah. No, now he just like. bases the hobble. Yeah, I don't like that at all. Wow, that was a bit horrible. Could have not bothered blitzing either of the blitzers and just mighty blowed the blockless guy in the middle to try and get another removal. Yeah, I think that would've been better than what he did because I, I would I would want to put you know put both balls on the same side to try and protect the ball. I guess he's just not going to deliver the ball this turn. But I think it was worth trying to deliver the ball this turn. Why not reroll? Because overtime the show won't keep the rerolls for overtime. Look has to dog. go backwards, I think. Oh, behind, yeah. So he's got four scoring threats, but two of them are based, so... <laughs> yeah. Yep, so he can blitz. Block him, block him, blitz him, base him. So he can, he can pretty much take care of it. Should have followed there. Okay. <laughs> Just stepped in afterwards anyway. Yeah. Um, because lit the man, it's just silly cyanide giving them horns when they shouldn't have done them. <laughs> they shouldn't have horns. They should have hats on. They should have glorious hats. That's annoying for him, isn't it? 
and I have to re-roll that. Yes, you don't want to give up a re-roll for overtime, but on the other hand, you don't want to just fucking lose either, do you? <laughs> Not power in there means he has to stand up his guys up here. Oh, he's had one though, he's had one, so... Not that big a deal, actually. That's worth a re-roll, let's stop this edge 4-1, edge 2-1. Don't re-roll it, man, you don't want to just lose, yeah, good. Oh, oh yeah, you can write him off with being after. Another one in 9. Ouch. Hello, BZL, glorious! Perfect for playing some Blood Bowl and spouting some insane insults at your opponent. <laughs> and blaming it on being on a train. <laughs> I, I had to tell my opponent that his mum should die of cancer. I'm on a train. <laughs> you can't get an easy 2D on this guy. It's like a GFI, or it's got to be a GFI, or a dodge or something. Crazy, eh? Yeah, GFI. That's the bow. And obviously you'll be re-rolling the handoff here. <laughs> oh, 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 yes he will. Oh, 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 he's made it. There you go. Well, I'm a little bit sad that it's not gone over time. <laughs> but, there you go. Congrats, yep, there we go. Congratulations, Wolf Buck. Commiserations yeah. to Cyber Knight. Bit anticlimactic, but that's a good, a good example of why you should always try to score on turn eight, shouldn't you? You know, maybe, maybe Cyber Knight should have gone for a riskier stall, you know, for the, t till turn eight, because... It's, it's tricky, isn't it? You know, he had the wizard as well, so it was, it was going to be really hard to shut down the chance. Especially being down men as well. Loads of Kaz and KOs for, for Wolf Bark. Yeah, I mean, in, in the end, just really, really key and repeated one in nines cost Cybernite. Yeah. Like repeated. <laughs> Zero. <laughs> so I, think from... it, I was... <laughs> I was just it. I'm being I'm being cast. Yeah, zero out of five catches, but that was uh, that was a stupid one that didn't matter. But the the double fail pickle was was the biggest thing after the wizard use. Twenty four, thirty three, twenty two. Compared to thirty two, twenty three, twenty two. So really, pretty bad dice from Wolf Bar. Block dice. Um, good dodging and GFI and stuff. But yeah, mostly weird weird game, wasn't it? Weird game. Um, so yeah, brilliant. Another win for Chorfs, the best team in Champs Ladder. <laughs> Congratulations, Wolfpack. <laughs> Commiserations Please. to Cyber Knight. Thanks for watching, everybody. Thanks for the cold cast, Artemis. You're welcome. And if you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic. <laughs>